Is it correct like this? Yes. Okay, so this is the answer for partial Z, partial X. Next, we'll move on to the Y part. Y, 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 Y. So partial Z, partial Y. So, this is the answer for the Y? Yes. Next will be the D, Z. Cool. Is it correct? Yes. So, for this, D, Z. <coughs> D, Z will be these two, this one times D, X. They all have the D, D Y, y and y. then together. Because they have the same denominator, so we can stick them the together. <laughs> stick them. Two things stick. Combine. Combination. So is this the answer? Yes. Okay. So we find the answer. This is the total differentiation. But that's the first question. question. Okay, next will be the second question. Okay, it's the same thing. the 
second question. It's still the same, right? Yes. Okay. Now, can I call this U, B, W? No, no W, because it is just one letter. Yes. It can just use itself. Yeah. I think U, B, W, X, Y, Z. U, B, Z. Yes. In the power U, X, Y, shut up. Say U, B, no W, X, Y, Z. Like this? Yes. Okay, so we actually have two messages right now. Okay. Either partial F, then the partial X. Or, no, just straight away. Okay, so which one would you like? So would you like straight away? Okay, so straight away. So it's from here. I will get into a power of X. Whoops. Oopsie. So just just a partial F, partial U. Partial U, partial X. X plus partial F, partial V, partial V, partial X. Then we'll plus again partial F, partial Z. Then partial Z, partial X. Is it correct? Yes. This is a zero. But, but do we just stop here as a zero? Yes. yes. So partial F, still partial U, but there will be this e to the power of x because it's it's for this x, so it doesn't change. But here sign y still stays the same. Plus, okay, so this will be a true x partial f partial b plus okay so this partial z partial x do we know what is it no right actually okay no. so this is the same so there's this u v and then z Okay, I'm write this as F3, then this will be the F2, and then this is the F1, then here is a 0. Uh -huh. so, so we'll just change this to the other end, and what will happen? So this is a negative, and it will come back this part. Okay. So this will be this negative e to the power of x, f1, sine y plus 2x, f2 over f3. Okay. Am I right? Okay. Next is partial f, partial e, u. Then partial u, partial y, plus partial f, partial v, partial v, partial y, plus partial f, partial z, z. partial z, partial y. Yes. Yes. Something like 
like this. Okay. Don't stand on it. So like this, then we'll know what it's partial set. Partial y. This one well is a negative into the power of x at one cosine y plus two y f two over f three. This is it. This times dx, this times dy, add them together. Because they are both are negative, so they will cancel each other, right? Can they won't cancel each other. Could they stay there and be friends? Yes. It don't attack. Is this the answer? Yes. Okay, so are you clear? Yes. Okay, do I understand? Really? Yes. Okay, so we'll end here. Okay. Bye. Bye.